Hi, I'm Steve Mackay uh, from EIT and IDC. And in today's quick presentation, I want to talk about the engineering value of death, which I see quoted in a few articles over the last week. Um, essentially, the concept is that when the kids, uh, young ad adults as we can call them, get to about 12, 13, they lose interest in science, engineering, mathematics, programming. And in fact, um, you'll find there's a trip tremendous drop off and then about when they get to about 18, 19 there's only a small fraction of the school cohort that actually go into engineering or scientific uh, careers which is a terrible shame um, and we can observe that a lot of kids up to about 10, 11 are actually really enthusiastic about science engineering projects, they get involved with uh, Lego Mindstorms, writing programs, um, scientific projects um, building Meccano sets, which from my time, and of course, um, as I said, when they get to about 12, 13, there's a terrible drop off in interest in those areas. How do we address this um, deficiency or this drop off? I think one of the suggestions beside, of course, getting good teachers, getting more teachers, getting volunteers from industry involved with schools, is also to um, try and join up with business. So, for example, if students are really enthusiastic about business and English, put an engineering or a scientific uh, bias to that. For example, business, you can get the students to create a um, application which they can then market and sell. So in other words, they can link up with business. And I think ultimately that's what we should be getting our engineers, our scientists involved with, is uh, projects which have a business or a communication bias. So in other words, um, that may be one way of getting rid of the engineering value of death, which is a terrible um, shame in our society. So that's all for me, Steve Mackay from EIT.